Hello my dear children. Welcome to Learner's Planet. Children, this is a quiz session about light and shadow. So children, we will start with the first activity. That is fill in the blank. Okay children, I read the sentences for you and you have to guess the correct answer from the options given in the bracket. Okay children, so we will start with the first one. A shadow is formed on the dash side of the light. Yes, children, where is shadow formed? Is it formed on the same side of the light or the opposite side of the light? Yes, children, we studied about it. What will be the answer? Yes, a shadow is formed on the opposite side of the light. Okay children, now the next one. A shadow is formed because the object dash let light pass through it. So children, when is a shadow formed? When the object allows the light to pass through it or it does not allow the light to pass through it? Yes, a shadow is formed because the light does not let light pass through it. If the object does let light pass through it, then a shadow is not formed. So always remember this. Now the next one children. The sun looks like a big ball of dash. So children, what the sun looks like? Does it look like a big ball of fire? Or a big ball of water? Yes children, it's very simple. The sun looks like a big ball of fire. Okay children, now the next one. We can get light from dash when there is no sun. Yes children, from where do we get light when there is no sun? For example, at night, at night there is no sun. So where do we get light from? Do we get it from torch or the bottle? Well, we get light from many things. But you have to answer from these options. Do bottle provide us light? No. So, the correct answer is torch. We can get light from torch when there is no sun. Okay children, now the next one. Shadows in the morning and evening are dash. Yes, children. 
when we step out of the home in the presence of sun then shadows are formed so children are long shadows formed in the morning and evening or short shadows formed in the morning and evening yes shadows formed in the morning and evening are long okay children now we will move on to the next activity that is questions and answers so children name any three sources through which we can get light when there is no sun so children there are many sources through which we can get light but we will write only three sources here as asked in the question so the first one we use is tube light so children when there is no sun we get light from tube light the second one we can also get light from the torches and we can get from electric bulbs also so children these are some sources through which we can get light when there is no sun we can also get light from burning candles as well as lantern okay children now the next one are shadows of the same length at all times of the day so children are shadows of the same length in the morning at noon and in the evening is it true yes or no the answer is no why because the shadow formed in the morning and evening are long but the shadow at the noon is shortest okay children is it clear now we will move on to the next activity that is multiple choice questions okay children so i will read the first question for you a dark patch seen on the ground when you walk in the sun is called a dash so children what it is called as is it a shadow or b sun rays yes children what is that dark patch seen on the ground called as yes it is called a shadow so a is the correct answer now the next one a shadow is formed on the dash side of light yes children we solve the same question 
in the filling the blanks try to recall is a shadow formed on same side of light or the opposite side of light yes a shadow is formed on the opposite side of light so d is the correct answer okay children now the next one shadow in the morning is dash so children is the shadow in the morning small or long yes children yes shadow in the morning is long so b is the correct answer now the next one this is also very simple shadow in the evening is dash so children is the shadow formed in the evening small or long yes shadow formed in the evening is long so b is the correct answer now the next one shadow at noon is dash so children is shadow formed at the noon is small or long yes children the shadow formed at noon is small so a is the correct answer so children i hope you enjoy solving these interesting question and answers and you learned about light and shadow so children always keep enjoying and studying keep smiling children thank you